Hello, IPXers. We're here, Embedded World 2025. We're joined by... Raul Vergara from, from Tissel Technologies. At the giant pink X. It's even bigger than the one we have at the studios. How exciting is that? Now, we were going to do a short, so we're going to do a short, but we're going to make it slightly longer than the short because you deserve longer than a short. Now, we did an excellent video with your CEO, Window, who went into more depth uh, on, our, in, uh, on our community and on our, on our channel on YouTube. But we're going to use the short prompt to say, who are you, what are you, why are you, and where are you? And you're Perfect. allowed to do others if you want, but let's just stick to the plan. <laughs> yeah, I will. So first of all, who are you? So uh, we are Thiso Technologies. We are a California-based company that focuses on security for IoT devices. What do we do? <laughs> I know. But I'll, I'll expand it, no, okay. right? No, it's okay. I didn't even know what the second question was. And I do this all day long. I do this for a living. <laughs> what? No, so what we do is we, we provide a platform with intent to democratize security, meaning it's easy for everyone to implement security. Kind of an abstraction layer where you don't have to figure out the hard parts. We do it for you. It's a SaaS platform. All you have to do is interact with our piece of software. It does all the magic for you. Your devices are secure from the moment they turn on to when you are doing updates over the air. So what you're saying is you, you create a device, let's say an HAI device, out in the field, doesn't matter where it's deployed. So for the point that you've made it to the point you deploy it, you just, if, if they use the, th the Thistle platform software, every element of security is taken care of yep. from start to finish. 100%, yes. Right. I think in that answer, you covered off the why. Well, a little bit of why is it is hard to do. So for you to do this, it takes you 12 to 18 months per device to implement if you have the resources in-house. So we're trying to reduce that time to weeks. And you don't need to have the security know-how now. All you have to do is continue with your knowledge of IoT and use our APIs to interact and get your answers back, but you don't have to be a core security uh, expert. It, the platform does it for you. Right, so, uh, so, that, so an absolute key answer to that is if you've got a device and you're trying to implement security and you've got lots and lots of things that you've got to make secure, that may take over a year to do. And what you're saying is you don't need to do that because our platform has got all of that covered and we're yep. doing that intuitively up front. Okay, and then where? Where where do you see where do you see the success and what kind of devices that you'll see your platform deploy? Yeah, so definitely who can use our platform? Absolutely everyone. We have from three tiers to and sorry, to enterprise tiers. But from an industry perspective, of course, everyone who's deploying devices, but I if I want to narrow it a little bit more. People who are concerned about security, of course, right? But they haven't had time to deploy. They're re letting it go for next release. They want to do it now. But if you need your device to have an update at some point in time, it doesn't have to have many, but it's a concern of yours. Well, that's just about every device. At, you would at... think so, you would think so. But a lot of people are just releasing devices out there and not caring about that. We'll fix it in the next version because it's too hard to implement, right? So everyone who wants to avoid that commercial impact, they're uh, you know, being hacked or, or getting into trouble with, with their brand, they want to do it now. And I think there's, there's some critical uh, devices out there, like medical devices. Pacemakers are unprotected. You, know, you should be protecting those as well, right? Medical devices, industrial, uh, anything that has to do with privacy, um, any device that are doing AI, you need to update those models. Those models are every day, you're updating, right? You're learning new things, uh, you know, Update, being able to update those and not worried about security. Did I update the, the right one? Is it the one that he's supposed to have? Yes. So all of those are our customers, but you're right. You know, IoT is everywhere. And it's such a massive surface attack. Our idea is that if we make it faster to implement and cheaper than doing it on your own or bring a contractor, you should be doing it and everybody should be doing it. Yeah, yeah. So last question. I've listened to everything that you've just said. I've listened to Windows video, uh, video on IP Exchange, so, which has got the more in-depth in answers. Um, how do I go about evaluating your platform? What's the, what are the first steps of doing that? Yes, yeah, so uh, like I mentioned, we have a free tier. So if you want to go to our website, sign up and get an account, you can go do that. That's one way. Um, if you want to explore on your own, if you are not allergic to talking to us, send us a note from you know on our website sign it up we will we'll talk to you we're happy to demo we're happy to do a workshop with you to show where you know where security 
is supposed to be and how it's supposed to do. Yep. Um, and we're happy to do that with, with you.